Well, I just picked up a bunch of rotors, a strut, a couple struts, those aluminum wheels. Don't know what those are bringing now. Now I've got these pipes strapped on the. It, it's they're probably aluminum. But... God. Son of a. Shit. <laughs> Damn, that hurt. Well, it's Tuesday. I'm going to the scrapyard, and if it's not trains, it's big Tonka trucks stopping the roads. I have uh, <coughs> got a pretty good load on here. I've got some um, compressors, a couple uh, dryer cords. And then I've got some copper and some ACRs, but very little. I meant to see what the copper brings. I've found a copper pot and what appears to be a copper cup. So, be interesting to see what that stuff brings. If I make it there without hitting another train. See that guy right there? Still, he's at a red light. He don't care things come up I leave and them crossing bars go out of the way they just go if not just a railroad crossing but they got red lights too some devious bastard come up with that formula but and then I've got I'm gonna hit a uh, commercial account get behind on there's probably six or seven stores that I need to pick up at and the problem is, and, and it's a time factor that's all this is time you know I can't do it during the day when I'm working so I'm either doing it on my day off or I'm gonna have to start going there in the evening when I get off and doing it either way I will get it done because that's a pretty good deal don't want to mess that up so we'll be at the scrapyard soon we're gonna go inside first drop off this non ferrous stuff and then see what load I have on here and get rid of it and then we'll be back at it I believe that train right there yep that almost caught me on them tracks That would have pissed me off. You know, and there's nobody out here again, guys. I, I, I don't get it. You know, they say it's not affecting them, but it's the middle of summer and there's nobody out dumping scrap, really? I just find that hard to believe. Nobody in here either. They're getting close, so. What up, my man? How you doing, buddy? <coughs> How we doing? How are you doing? Me too. <laughs> you tell me, what's number one? What the hell is that? Well, that's brass.
That's it. big honking piece of aluminum. tomorrow too. Oh, yeah. See you brother. Yeah, See you Tyler. Is that all you got? Just this? This is it. All right. That's all I got. Anywhere in the middle? He's supposed to be dropping off rotors. That guy? That Well the white truck should be leaving here little shortly. The guy in the van's got some rotors to drop off. Okay. Well let's go get rid of this
Should have kept the camera running. I don't know if you all remember what's one of our last videos. That girl that got, or whatever it is, got Marilyn in trouble by telling them that they always let her drop her scrap off even though her license is expired. Now she's back again. She wanted to know if she could use my license to pick up her scrap. <coughs> I'll let you all comment what my what you think my response was to that. Let's see how many of you know me as well as you think you do. All right. The neighbor, my next door neighbor brought over some copper. He's got a big goddamn looks like a used oil tank there I got to cut up and some miscellaneous stuff, but two or three lines of copper. Attached to one of them was a brass valve that I cut off. That brass valve paid $7.75. The three compressors I had, it was 72 pounds. They're paying 11 cents a pound. That was 7.92. The copper, not just those three lines, but I found two. Found a copper pot and a copper glass. That paid 20 dollars and 40 cents. That piece of aluminum extrusion that was kind of heavy, paid a buck 74. And those three or two little bitty radiator ACRs I had, they paid 560. I had 880 pounds for 6160. And the dryer cords paid five dollars and twenty cents for a total of 110. So what I'm gonna do now is take this aluminum stuff that I didn't throw out I kept I'm gonna take it back to the barn and get rid of it that way my bed's empty and then I'm gonna go do a commercial account and then dump it and then I'm gonna go south do my third side hustle make a little money so we'll see what happens I'll be back at some point I'm tired of this damn thing just I mean are you I mean do you even come are you coming on or these things is getting on my damn son no fine just stay down there Why is the light on? Ah, oh, son of a... No, what are you beeping about? I didn't even turn you on. You know, Jesus, Pete. Let me tell you something, buddy. You're fixing to take a... Damn it. Oh, I hate that turtle hitch. Asshole.